If you're thinking of buying a home, there are a few costs that you might consider or might want to obviously think about and put into your budget per se. Um, your down payment, your home inspection fee, and that home inspection fee that you pay, it kind of depends, well, it doesn't kind of, it does depend on the size of, size of the property and the type of property, whether it's detached or attached, has a pool, etc. That can change that uh, particular price. And that home inspection that you initially do might lead to more inspections. Um, also, your closing costs, your homeowner's insurance, which homeowner's insurance has always been a big deal, but it can be a little bit more challenging these days depending on where the property is located. Uh, so it's very important that you do your research on that. Um, agent commissions and home specific costs and fees and prorated taxes. There's obviously a lot more fees uh, that will possibly come into play just depending on the type of um, items that are negotiated, the uh, particular offer that you write, etc. Certain things might come up, you might um, ask for a credit and that's something that is would be credited towards you. So I mean there's a lot of different fees that come into play. If you have any questions in regards to any of this, I would highly suggest that when you are speaking with an agent and you are looking for a property, that you ask them to get you or to provide you with a buyer's estimated closing statement. And that will give a little bit more detail in regards to some of the fees. Obviously, like I said, it's an estimate. So it kind of gives you a little bit of an idea it is very important that you obviously know what you're getting into and what you need to bring to the table um, money-wise uh, when you're purchasing a property. So I hope this is helpful. And if you have any questions, my email is below, above, beside, wherever, wherever this is posted. Look around, you'll see it. So make it a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye.